what's going on guys it's chad here welcome back to another red dead redemption 2 video thank you guys for all the love and all the support on the previous videos i do appreciate it you guys have been killing on the channel the last couple of days and i kind of wanted to reward you guys again with another red dead redemption video um we're gonna hop back into the story here if you like this content drop a like comment subscribe turn on your bell notifications so you know whenever i post follow me on my instagram for more and uh let's do this all righty we back in here to this game i forgot what are my controls and key binds all right can i put that back up thank you i'll be pulling that out there buddy i right, get my controller back right, let's call my horse come on horse let's go Man was like a G. Actually, let me put on my bandana. I like to have it on. You feel me? I really like to have the bandana on. I think it's really cool for me to do that. All right. So what are we doing today? Let's go over. Um, I see an A on the map. Uh, Abigail. And then there's this little side mission thing here. Let's do the side mission first. See how this goes. And then we'll continue with the main missions. My crimes have been forgiven around here, so I'll be fine. You got a problem? Nah, you shut your mouth, boy. Who are you talking to? Let's go this way. I hope you guys had a good week. Um, I know it's Sunday. And uh hope you guys had some good Sunday lunch and yeah. um hope you guys remember to go after all you guys goals and dreams. Remember what I those of you who watched my video this morning or this afternoon, I hope you understand what I said and um the kind of things that you you know that you understand what I said and you kinda take some of the stuff that I talked about into your own lives and you improve on whatever it is that you've been you've been doing you get what i'm saying so hope you guys enjoy the yeah. video and i hope it helps some of you in you guys' journey and the stuff that you have been you know thinking about doing with your lives etc etc remember to keep going after your goals and keep going after your dreams like you guys got this i wasn't kidding when i said that and um i'm very very serious so um yeah we're gonna continue over here do this mission and uh see how this this thing goes um i think it's that's the guy up there i gotta give him some plants so let's see how this goes him i assume this is gonna it's not letting me give the plants okay well i guess i gotta find them first all right well we ain't we ain't we, well we're going we're going back over here to do this one then because i have no clue where to find these plants i ain't i ain't wasting no time doing all that so let's go let's go maybe you guys can let me know down in the the comment section where I can possibly find some of these plants that they've been asking me to go and get for William. William looked kind of cracked on his mind though. I'm not gonna lie. Is this the man that invented crack, bro, or marijuana, or whatever, or got it or something? Like this man, this man looks cracked out of his mind. Not gonna lie. If he's such a herbalist, why does he look so unhealthy? You get what I'm saying? It's crazy how some of these uh, herbalists, like, oftentimes look kind of unhealthy. So. I, I always question that. You, you get what I'm saying? Like, and I hope this doesn't offend you. If it doesn't, well, if it does, well, I personally don't care. But at the same time, like, let's let's have a, a honest adult conversation about it. Like, why do a lot of herbalists oftentimes look unhealthy themselves? You get what I'm saying? Like, 
that doesn't make sense if you're you're claiming to be so you know into the uh the herbs and different things like that in, in terms of health etc why do you look unhealthy get, get me but you know it is what it is this is hunting i think charles is for hunting i don't want to hunt really so mr morgan whatever did happen with that mary gillis uh, it all came to nothing this grimshaw mm, that's for the best okay sure. of course i never did like her very much that sucks oh he was probably clapping those cheeks though i'm not gonna lie come here a minute what is hmm, she's kind of cute though <laughs> Can I ask you a favor? All right, never mind. Probably not. She stood up and I was like, never Very mind. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? Because he likes you and, well, you know his father's useless. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Thank you. Jack, is that a little kid? When is the chow bell gonna ring? There is. Bro, you better hurry up with that food. Why are they letting a kid like this just walk around, bro? So, suppose he just runs away. Come on, Jack. Let's go. What you up to? Playing. Anything fun? I guess. You Being a child in, with me. Imagine a child in this, in this time sure. must have been pretty hard. <laughs> It's about time that you start to earn your cape. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. I'll mount up. All right, let's go up here and see what's going on. Come on, Jack. Let's go. Where did he put that fishing? What? What the heck? It's interesting. All right, hold on tight. So, where are we going? Just down to the river near here. We shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling yep. better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're a brave kid. So, just like you. Well, I don't know about brave. I ain't much, ain't of, much of a kid, kid no more. more. Well, your mama might disagree. There are a few other women, I guess. What do you mean? Uh, I'm just talking silly. <laughs> it's been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. Sure when are you going do. back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, we're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Why? I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. All right. Storybook. This looks as good a spot as any. All right, Jack. Let's go, buddy. We gonna be a father today. Where should we stand, Uncle Arthur? Down by the shore. Come on, follow me. Come on, Jack. First, we need to use the bait wheel, use cheese, bread, corn bait, use some cheese. Bait. I'm gonna use some cheese. Cheese? Smellier the better. Now, cast your line, swing the rod back over your shoulder, and bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. Mm hmm. Like that? That's it. Good. All we do now, Jack, is wait for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? 
Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. He's nibbling. If you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait, so mm -hmm. yank hard to hook it. Something's tugging at your rod, Uncle Arthur. Ah, didn't hook him. Uncle Arthur! Okay. Whoop, got one. Got your ass, boy. You see him fighting there, Jack? That's right. when you gotta be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear him out first before you try to reel him in. Now, well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling him in nice and steady. Let's go, buddy. I got your fish. Got myself a fish. Look, Jack, it's a bluegill. It's almost as small as you. We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give them a chance to grow up a bit. Don't throw this one back. Can I take a break from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. All right, Jack. I'm going to get another fish. I'm going to pick some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. All right. When it tugs. Oh my gosh. To take a stronger bite. Okay. There we go. Got your ass. Start reeling this bad boy in. You gotta stick at things, Jack. I know. Hmm. This is a pretty small one, though. Oh, this one's a red fin picker. Not bad. Is it small or? I'll keep this one. Fishing sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. Yeah, I know. It was boring as boring hell. Boring as hell. But then, something happens. And you can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. Mm hmm But until then, you just sit and wait. And try not to worry. Mm-hmm. Good for I've you. never actually gone fishing IRL. Good for you? I've actually never I done it. Huh. I guess it would be pretty cool to go on thing. There, got him. I see. I see. What are you making there? No fish. It's a surprise. Got another fish. Uh, so eleven pound one. Hey, look at this. The what? Mm, this necklace cool. I made. Necklace for Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. And in such complex circumstances, Arthur, huh. isn't it? Arthur Morgan. Oh, they they roll up on me like that. Yes. Arthur Morgan, Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. Oh boy. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphaned street kid seduced by that maniac's silver tongue and matures mm -hmm. into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton, Agent Ross, Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. Five thousand dollars for your head alone. $5, Damn. Thousand dollars. I've already worth five thousand. That's crazy. Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so. Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Hmm. Oh, ain't that a little 
Old-fashioned nowadays. Apparently not. Listen. Uh-huh. This is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent. Uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong. Aside from not playing the games to your rules. Exactly. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. That sucks. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, hmm. but merciful. Slow, but merciful. You enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us, sooner than others. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is getting hey, good. Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. While you still can. <laughs> I would have shot that dude. Who are they? No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Let's pick up your things and get home. I don't like that, bro. I don't like that. It's getting late, Jack. Your mother will be worried. Let's head back. Hmm. That's, a, that's a little bit of storytelling right there. They oh, want... This is a large horse. Come on, Jack. Let's go. Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Because, well, because those are disagreeable men. It's crazy how adults have to talk what around they mean about Matt? little children. Is he in jail? About, the, the, about children. No, I don't uh, think so. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. That's why mm -hmm. you got all of us to protect you from folk like them. Now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. Well, did you like fishing? It was. Okay, I think. It's a lot of waiting around. It is. <laughs> Alright. I guess it's gonna there automatically hit pitch our horse. How you boys get known? Great! We caught a fish and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Ain't that the luckiest? Mm -hmm. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, you did real fine, kid. Thanks. Yeah, kid. We got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella named um, Milton and uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And? and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Why didn't you take Very it? Very funny. Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing just yet. They're just trying mm. to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. Oh boy. We survived them mountains. We just need to stay calm. In the eyes of the law like that, we do. Fisher of men. Let's get a thumbnail real quick, y'all. I think I I stopped it at like the absolute worst time. Let's go over by our horse. Let's go over by our horse. Morgan, you got any hair pomade? 
Does it look like I got any here, poor May boy? What's wrong with you? Alright. Let's get a thumbnail here. Okay. Let's just see and make sure that this is going to work. Um, pictures, screenshots. All right. All right, let's make sure that is working. I think it is. Why did it go up with that thing? Bro, I took that off. What the heck? Okay, this thing is annoying. Let's do this. And did it, did it just act up? Sure, I hope it didn't. Oh, there we go. We good. We good. All right, we got ourselves a thumbnail right here. Let's grab our horse. Let's continue. Yeah. Alright, we are going to head out over to this next story mission right here in Valentine. John Morrison. Right. I almost thought it was John Morrison. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that wrestler. That's what I was thinking just now. But, oh well. Let's keep going though. See what's going on. Hey, this man's got his sheep going. Man's got his sheep. Whatever that is, is dead. You're all right, boy. Let's calm our horse down a little bit. Yeah, okay, boy. And let's keep going. Something just happened there. I saw blood on the ground. Are we in Valentine? Right now. Let's just go on the outer skirts and then move in over here. Um Alright, what is John? So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about him? You got any leads? I got something. Mm, what's your something? You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? <laughs> Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting that might work for dutch but for you it just makes you look stupid come along you'll see that train job was a start but we need more money until mm -hmm. we can get back to blackwater and collect i'm here okay. to tell you we try to collect that money anytime soon it'll come with a noose i was worried you'd say that Facts. dutch says that we... dutch says a lot that's his gift Same saying things, things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was okay. a prize pony once. Now I'm a workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well, you was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way, well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Facts! That's the way it goes, I guess. For me. Yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. Wonder what is this that he needs to pick up. There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. I already don't like how this is going. I don't like how it's going either. All right, let's hitch our horse. <sighs> Gun store. Yep. Can you uh head in, pick up a sniper rifle? Bro, on my money. Are you serious? Oh well, hello again. 
How can I help you? I wouldn't have bought Looking all those things. I wouldn't have. With a side on it. Shouldn't be a problem. I wouldn't have bought all those see things. What we got? It's all in the catalog here. Um, let's go to the catalog. View the rifles. I wouldn't have picked up all of those things if I knew that we were gonna do this. Oh, it's it's for free. Wait. Return to catalog. Can I get any other options or is it just this? Okay, it's just that. Alright. We got the rifle now. All right, at least it was free. <coughs> Good, sure. Let's go. All right. My horse needs some cleaning, but all right. Partner, you want another break? Yeah, okay, boy. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. Mm, I can you see that. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Facts. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl. What was her name? Mary? That was different. And he just bought no, a Mary. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know that place. Okay, so what does that have to do with us? Let me move this thing from the map. It's irritating me. There, boy. Come on, horse. Right, You're boy. good, boy. You're good. Okay. It's late. I think it's better to be this late already. Jesus. So I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collected on the sale. Now the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Okay. Let's see what we can see from up here. All right, let's see what he's talking about. I don't like it forcing me makes forcibly makes me slow down. Okay. I think that's them over there. So what now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. <laughs> Looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. You'll get the message. That ought to do it. All right, let's go I, round them up. I don't even see where anybody is. I was just randomly shooting. I see on the street. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here, there, but not much. Right. Those cowboys I know. Dumbest trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's I get guess these so. things. Bring them back to the yards. They're pretty scattered. 
Let's get them all rounded up. Hold on now. <laughs> Move it up. Head for town. You know what? Marshal, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. Come on. One stuck. Now you got it. Yeah, yeah. All right. Calm it down. Quickest route back to Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay. All right, we gotta that herd these sheep all I'll the way over there. This. Interesting. <laughs> Match their speed. Okay. Come on, sheep, let's go. We're going. Come on, sheep, let's go. We're going. Let's go. Why are you hitting the horse, though? It's my question. Yeah, yeah. Come on, sheep. Let's That's go. More like it. Let's go, yeah. sheep. Oh, shoot. I almost trampled that sheep, bro. That's crazy. Hey, keep it pushing, sheep. Keep it pushing. Come on, sheep. Let's go. All right, we got most of them there. Alright, we got the sheep. We got those sheep in. Fine sheep. They're okay. Well, you seem better around here. They're I've okay. Seen there is with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me. Sure, I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. <laughs> Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, uh. You're buying. But we're paying. Go on now. Interesting. Okay. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch sure. is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? How would you know that? Interesting. I wonder how he knows yeah. that. 18%. I thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. Can't herd, can't, can't swim. swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. Yeah, you still can't do those stuff, bro. It never really was. Oh. Meet Dutch at the saloon. Okay. <coughs> you bet keep riding. I don't know who that person's talking to. 
Well, it better has dog BB. Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a whiskey. Not every day, but in the end, I don't believe in absolute okay. shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Well, I have never been a man for compromises, and I fear at my age I okay. am too old to change. Oh boy, what's going on Have here with that? Sir. Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, All right. where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And working. We're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why mm -hmm. don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen, drink? Sure. <clears throat> sure. Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. Very, very strange. To your good health. Thank you. What the hell? Vandaland! You oh, this is gonna be a shootout. You keep robbing me! My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you! Get out here before I have these men killed! What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash! You start spinning a yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. I got where I am by letting Scott block you rob from me, Vandalin. You're done. Huh. Now get out here now. Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case okay. of mistaken identity. What is worse than admiring oh, yeah. a man for the look crazy. of another who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want this Dutch Vanderlyn, whomever he may be. Boom. Yeah, yeah. You know what? This is what y'all get. This is what y'all get. Y'all thought it was sweet. Y'all thought it was sweet. Yeah, this is what I've been waiting for. Shoot people. There you going? That's right at them. Arthur, cover us! John will push the wagon! Arthur, shoot someone! This man is not going down, thank you. Oh, shoot. Get behind the wagon as we push, Arthur! You can use it as cover! What are we doing? Get down of here! I'm being hit pretty damn hard. Uh. It's just a scratch. Shut up. You can talk. We all heard you whine about a little nick from a wolf. Um. Yeah, I just got this. Would you shut up and kill these bastards? For crap's sake, why are they so hot? Why don't you run now while you still can? This is madness! You're on the front line now, Mr. Strauss! 
Bro. Stop trolling. Well, he got destroyed right there. What'd you say to me, boy? Can I at least draw my gun? Somebody's horse is acting up. Strauss on the back of John's horse, and let's get out of here. All right, all right, come on, man. Get him. You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Sure. All right, I Can't guess we're moving out of here. This. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. Who is the mother? All right, let's go. We're killing everybody now. What? I don't I don't feel that. I don't really feel that at all. Let's go horse. Where's my horse going? Yeah, get shit on. Let's go. Let's get out of here, y'all. Yeah. A lot of searching, y'all ain't gonna find me. We out of here. We Audi. Five oh, gotta go. Let's get out of here. The police on us. The ops are on us. I took a lot of shots though, I'm not gonna lie. Um yep. took a whole lot of shots right there. Alright, let's start heading back over to where we are camped. Alright, we escaped the law. Sheep and the goats. Leviticus Cornwall. You got out of there pretty quick, bro. Yeah. You run from something, my boy? We're coming for you. Try to kill us. We're coming for you, man. Pack it up. We gotta pack it up around here. Let's brush our horse off because we didn't get to do it before. We gotta brush the horse off right here. Can I not brush the horse off? What the heck is going on? Why can't I brush the horse? Alright, never mind. Let's go to Dutch. Heading east. Is that the plan? For now. And when do we stop? When we reach Paris? So, we moving? Yeah. We stop when we find some place sensible, shake them that's following us, and lie low. This is lying low? 
We turned into a bunch of killers, I mean it. We ain't even got the delusion of being anything but a bunch of killers. We are just trying to survive, Hosea. We don't have a choice. This will end soon. Damn right it will. Constipated as usual. Micah told me of a place we can lie low. Look here. Mm -hmm. Dewberry Creek, he said. Okay. Maybe you and Charles can go take a look. Well, we'll go off take a look. you find before the whole lot of us move in looking so conspicuous. And how are we gonna do that? I don't know. Start dancing? Looks like I turned into a goddamn errand boy. You have turned into my son. You worry because I worry. We are just the same. Charles, come with me. Okay. We got work to do. Now, where have I heard that before? Charles seems really cool. I'm not gonna lie. Can I can I brush my boy off now? Okay, good. Let's brush let's brush this good horse down. Get all this dirt and muck off of him. Gotta get his coat nice and pretty again. All right, boy, you good? You good? You good? You good? There we go. I think he's good now. So, are we riding there? Well, duh. What are we gonna do? Walk? So where are we going? Find a new spot to camp. We're packing up and moving on. Gotta pack up and move on. Again? We have to. And fast. We'd already pushed our luck too far before that mess we just made in Valentine. Ah, uh, that didn't sound good. Uh, it killed isn't. a lot of law. Killed a lot of Cornwalls. They Facts. must know where we are by now. So, we're heading south? Yeah. Area, area called, called Dewberry Creek. Creek. Dutch wants us to give it a look. Let's give Make it a sure look it's then. Clear and a good place to lie low for a while. I've only known him a few months, but the way he talks, I never thought I'd see him wanting to head south. Right. And I know by now there ain't no lying low. There's too many of us for that. And there ain't no way Dutch is gonna just hide away in a cave somewhere. Goes against everything he stands for. Let's look at the map real quick. Can I go down here? I should be able to, right? Four. That'd be admitting we're nothing more than low down criminals. Which we are. Hey, hang on a second. I think that must be it up ahead, the old dried up creek. Seems very open. It's a yeah, open. it does. Ain't sure to be the best in the rain, neither. Well, let's take a look around. Hey, I see something over there. You see it? Someone on the ground there. Mm. Person's on the ground. He's been shot. Looks like trouble got here before us. Yep. Man's dead. Mm. This is crazy. There's a camp just up ahead. Sure. Let's get ready for business. All right, Charles, let's go take a look. Look, here it is. A few tents, but the place looks empty. Let's have a look around uh -huh. and make sure. Let's see what's going on up in here. There ain't nothing up there. People tried to be here, but... Maybe they hurt. Uh, let's take this canister. Be careful. I'm being careful. Alright, let's look around and see what's going on up in here. Insert crates. It's okay. It's okay. How come they didn't instantly shoot them? Come out of there. 
You okay? You don't mean no harm. Interesting. There's a lot of mosquitoes right here right now. I don't know why. He said, are you okay? Sprechen Sie Deutsch? German? No. Now go on. Get out of here. Go. We need the land. Go. Get the hell out of they here. They took our father. Who did? Men. Last night. Where? Where did they take him? It ain't no business of ours. I don't even speak their language. You ain't as tough and dense as all that. Come on, Luther. Okay. Now oh, we gotta find out where the these. The girl was pointing this way. Let's see if we can pick up a trail. Okay. There. Tracks. Come on. I don't. Button. Um, hoof marks. This way. What's going on? You. What do you mean? You were just going to send that woman and her children on their way? We're wanted, man. We got Pinkertons breathing down, down our, our necks. necks. We should move in camp, not running off on some wild goose chase. Come on, Arthur. That's not how you are. Well, oh, it maybe is you wrong. don't know me as well as you think you do. I think this is the right way. Give me a second. I mean, people travel this road. The tracks would all be the same, though. Okay. Looks like they go down this way. Ah! Arthur. So, what happened with those Pinkertons, anyway? When you were fishing with Jack? Said they were on to us. Offered me freedom if I turned Dutch here. <laughs> they picked the wrong man there. Wait, just... Let me make sure this is right. You took him into the water, man. Continues along the shore. Anyway, you were saying? We should have moved right then, if you ask me. Easy. Bastards told me they killed Mac. Said it right in front of Jack. I don't think they did, uh, though. That kid. It's gonna be tough for him. Yeah. But he has more folk looking out for him than most of the rest of us had growing up. Facts. John said he was going back to the auction yard to collect the money for those sheep. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he After we he'd just shot it up. In and out. Oh, well. <laughs> if it's John's act, yeah, it must be a good one. <laughs> what is it with you and him? Hold up. Let me check this. Ah, uh, they continue on that trail ahead of us. Good eyes, Arthur. Let's keep on them. Yeah. We'll back to what you were saying. Uh, he disappeared on us for a while. When Jack was real young. A long while. You hear him? He did? Hey, quiet now. There's a camp up ahead. Be careful. Seems deserted. Let's take a look. It really seems that way. You, I wouldn't be trusting in people in this kind of time. I believe that people around this time were very uh, dishonest. So, it kind of makes sense for us to not trust anybody right now. But uh, where is this guy? Let's get I don't out. know. But you know something? This is a better camp spot than back there. Much easier to defend. Maybe. This looks like our feather, Charles. Quick, cut him free and let's get out of here. Vorsicht, Vorsicht! Das ist eine Falle, Vorsicht! Take cover! Three coming right. All right, y'all. What the hell do you think you're doing? Y'all thought that I was. Doesn't look like it. 
Oh my gosh. We got more running in. Out of here. Oh, he just ended that though. That's the, them dealt the with. Thing. You get him untied, and I'll see what they've left behind for us. It's okay. Getting you out of here. Vielen okay. Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Yeah, okay. Hey, you wait there a second. Charles, go find Dutch. Get the caravan to divert here. This spot should work for us. I really Thank should. Alright, let's go, buddy. Come on now, sir. Come on. Alright. Come on. I'll take you back to your family. Hat meine Familie sie geschickt? Also soll ich mitkommen? Ja. Alright, where is the family at? It's right here. Let's just go through here. He's lucky. Lucky we are good Samaritans today. Would have been my problem. None of my business. Where did you What the hell did you do to those fellas? Wie bitte? Those men back there. Why did they take you? Geld. Money. Meiner Familie gehört eine Goldmine. Sie wollen Lösegeld erpressen. How did someone even come up with them words? Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Uh, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. We're going back to this man's family. Let's see what we can do here. There they are. Dem Herrgott sei Dank. Andreas, oh. Andreas, mm. I thought you were dead. My heart, all my loves. Oh, how wonderful. You are a great man. Yes. A great man. Yes, really. It's a sign that we have met. Come on, now get out of here. This place ain't safe. Get out of here! Yeah, yeah, that's true. Vamos, vamos. I have something for you. One moment. Um, danke schön. Thank you. Vielen Dank, herzlichen Dank. Oh, shoot, man. A pleasure. Man gave him some gold. Yeah. That's heavy, bro. That looks pretty heavy. I mean, he could have robbed him too, but you know, life. Life. We don't need to do it. We don't need to do it. You were right. Oh, this place. Oh, it'll be perfect for us. Hello, Arthur. Dutch. Uh, <clears throat> See how this goes. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, put everyone to work. Make this place a home. Well, I don't know where the hell we are, but we are going to make the best of it. All right. He says this is easy to defend, I guess, so... You know, we are in chapter three now. How many chapters are there? Oh boy, I'm so tired, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I've been just, I don't know, let's say vibing. A few days later. All right. We got a gold ingot giving her can be sold at any fence for a large profit. Okay. See what that want. How you doing, old friend? <coughs> Fine. Fine. It's funny. Us in and up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. 
I see I'm boring you, Arthur. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, sure. there's gonna be casualties. Sure. We're thieves. This voice we acting is pretty good. Don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts. Now, I'll give you that, but come on. We right, got let's see what he wants. It's nice out. Old Jose says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of fish. You want me to go fishing again, bro? I don't want to go no fishing. Oh my gosh. I hope he doesn't want to take me fishing, bro. I don't want to fish. What's this fishing thing? Why does everybody want to fish? Hey, old girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good a long time. Okay, he's gonna make me fish again. This is gonna be annoying. This is gonna be very annoying. Let's go fishing. Come on then. Oh my gosh, who who wants to go fishing? I don't wanna go fishing. What's this, bro? Passing you. Go on. Hosea, hurry up, bro. We ain't got that kind of time to Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. And Before old any of guard. them back there, oh, there was us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels oh good here. You That's did well fun. finding that spot, Arthur. More Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again. Thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipes some good, Jose. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, Bessie. Feels like a Who's lifetime Bessie? ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived. How well we have Who's fought. Who's Bessie? Especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. But we don't have to hide. Sure. Uh, okay. Like where? Sure. I got some ideas hatching, but I need you with me, not against me. Both of you. Mm -hmm. Of course. Still, we do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But we'll start try turning over the soil and the rocks. See what turns up. That's Cost trouble. We've got to be discreet. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Hold. All right, these are law up ahead. Hello, gentlemen. Well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a spot to bother. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't Damn. sort this out. <laughs> well, how are you, boys? Fine. This is quite Fine. some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray, this is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. Archibald you. McGregor. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. <laughs> now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh, I wouldn't do that if I were you! I, shit! I, the Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big guy! Perhaps we can discuss the foolish magician. Let's go after that right. train! And do Let's not shoot them, you hear me? Come on, hurry! 
Come on, Archibald, hurry up. Will you relax? We're not losing them. Faster, come on. What's your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur Callahan. Faster, Mr. Callahan. Callahan, please. My neck is on the line here. I get it. I'm doing my best. So what are these fellas wanted for? Well, the Anderson boys? Robbery, murder, kidnapping. They're the lowest of the low. Looks like the son of a bitch is going to make it. You sure I can't just shoot him? No. Did I not say that? You sure I can't you shoot You said plenty. You all are a goddamn joke. Uh, idiot. Now get after the others. Come on. The train is slowing down to go through the station. Now's our chance. See if you can get alongside the train. I will yeah. try, but my horse ain't got that kind of stamina, man. Closer. Get us alongside it. See I'm alongside it. What's wrong with you? Get us as close as you can. You think you can jump on there? Me? Why me? Because you ride like my grandmother. I didn't do nothing. Damn you. Bro, get off of me. What's wrong with you? Get off of me. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Come on, Mr. Callahan. I'm relying on you. Running ain't gonna help. Running making it worse. Come on, boy. Come on, come on, come on. Bastard. Damn, bastard. Get the hell away. Oh, why am I? this. Gonna be dead soon, partner. Come on. You stop them. I'll stop the train. All right. Stop. Come here, boy. Come here. Bring yes, your me. butt here, boy. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Stop the train. It's just us then, lawman. Come here. Do we need to bother? Knife. Let me go. I can't do that. Why is he using a knife, bro? Come on, man. Do it. You're a joke. Just don't kill him. Are you sure? Sadly so. I don't think I can open the door from the outside, unfortunately. Need some gin? Come on. Come here. Ow. 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 Get off of me. What's wrong with you? Just beat his ass, boy. Hello? Yeah. Sit down, Is kid. All right in there? Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Oh, just a barrel. You got anything on him? I gotta pick his Saka. She's up. Bring him out here. Deputy. Sounded like quite a commotion. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. Mm -hmm. What now? Take him in. Come on. Fine job. Well done. And a pat nah, on the whatever. back for me for stopping the train. Okay, there you buddy. go. You are a natural. I used to kidnap people, so all right, let's take him in. Follow me. What about the others? Oh, we'll round them up. Anders back there is the brains of the operation, and that's really saying something. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit, I'd hazard a guess you've served the nice. law yourself at some point. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, no, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields. This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. Yes, we are in dire need of some rain around here. Let me tell you, the Grays have lived in Caliga Hall so for generations. Southern. Fine He's people. Kind of great, I My guess. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Road, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Ain't what it was before the war, but it has its charms. I'm mm. sure you already know of the Braithwaite. Braithwaite. Like I said, 
just got down We here. call it Brackley. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. Sounds like quite the place you got here. Interesting place. We're gonna bear left here. Then why didn't it take me with it? Alright, we're gonna try not to cause any trouble in the road. Let's try our best and let's not slip up. And that's somebody sleeping? No, it's not worse, I think. Here we are! Welcome to Rhodes! Up there on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Mm -hmm. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. Nice, nice, We nice. also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of course. What more do you need? Very little. Oh, good, they're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay, we're gonna stop just ahead on the right, outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab sheriff's Anders off your office. horse and carry him in for me? All right, let's get Anders. Chop, chop. Don't just leave him slumped on there for the whole town to see. Bring him in so we can show Sheriff Gray. Hey, fellas. Mm -hmm. Mr. Gray! We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you this was all just a big misunderstanding. However... I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mm -hmm. mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your friend behave. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How Interesting. Terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Now, Bo, these better be ugly rumors. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite? I can't thank you enough. Interesting. Where have you been? Around. And where are you staying? I'm renting a caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Gray's, and Braithwaite's. Interesting. Two mm -hmm. old plantation houses and falling out of rebel gold and marrying cousins or not marrying. Arthur, That's Jose, you start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Oh, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here. And it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're mm -hmm. good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was talk of super agents or some such. Super agents? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd love to meet one. It's just talk. I'm sure it is, but I couldn't know. Bro, I look like a cowboy. Stay cowboy. Out of trouble. Thank you, gentlemen. <laughs> Stay out of trouble, boy. Okay, so these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is there. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend Archibald. Good. Hosea, you see what you can find out about these brake weights. All right. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Arthur. Quite a fishing trip. At There's least we didn't time. go fishing. I'm up for it. How about you, Arthur? Nah. Not enough of the chase for one day. I don't want. I don't. I don't. I'm not going fishing, bro. Uh, I'll need to relax someplace. Fair enough. It looks like it's you and me, old man. I'm not going fishing, bro. No. Forget that. I'm not doing that, bro. It's no. I don't like fishing, bro. Not doing it. Anyways, that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys for all the love and all the support on these videos. I do appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day and have a great week. Let's save this real quick. Make sure to go after all you guys' goals and your dreams. You guys got this. I'll see you guys in the next video which will be on uh, monday anyways